Hello everyone, welcome to my channel if you're new and welcome back if you're returning. My name is Danielle and today I'm excited to unbox with you two smaller items that I received, one from Louis Vuitton and one from Gucci. I really wasn't planning on purchasing these items, but I'll tell you why I did purchase them and I wasn't planning on filming today. I've been running around and cleaning and doing lots of errands, so excuse me if I do look a little bit disheveled. I wasn't really planning to film, but this item from Gucci did come a day early and I do wanna start using it right away. I'm really excited to use this item, so I did want to go ahead and do a proper unboxing with you and share it with you before I start using it. So I'm gonna just do that quick today. So if you wanna see what I got from Louis Vuitton and Gucci, then keep watching. So let's start with the item from Louis Vuitton. Now I have been getting a ton of packages from Amazon and other places because obviously as you can well imagine, we are Christmas shopping right now, our entire family is, so we're all getting a lot of packages and we are doing Secret Santa in our household between the four of us. So we've had a lot of packages come recently. So yesterday I got this package from Louis Vuitton and I opened it and I didn't even realize that it was from Louis Vuitton right away because actually it didn't come in a Louis Vuitton cardboard box. You guys know that usually when you get an item from Louis Vuitton, the outside of the cardboard box is plain, but then when you open it up on the inside, upper flap, usually it says Louis Vuitton, but it didn't say that. And it was covered with all sorts of brown paper, so I didn't even really realize what it was right away because we were opening a lot of different Different packages we had a huge shipment of things in the mail yesterday but I did not open the box because I did want to unbox it with you so it did come with the receipt right here and then here's the box I really love the way that the box came packaged it came like this and I think that's really really pretty I've seen the bags that look like this I just love that now this item isn't a really exciting item I think a lot of us out there probably already have this item but it is a really hard to get item and that's why I decided to go ahead and get this and the item I purchased is the key clay now as I said I realize this item isn't really exciting because a lot of us do have it but the reason I went ahead and purchased this, even though I already have this item, is because the one I have is getting quite old and a little bit worn, and I wanted to go ahead and get this. And I happened to call the Northbrook store in Illinois, and they happened to have one right in stock, so I went ahead and ordered it from the store. It looks really good. The only thing that I can notice is, do you see there on the seam how it's not exactly lined up? What do you guys think about that? I don't love that. But I guess with smaller SLGs, I'm not really picky, but tell me what you think. I will probably take this in and just ask them about the stitching. It doesn't look like there's any gaps in the stitching at all, but it does look like it's a little bit crooked on the bottom and not really lined up. So you guys tell me what you think about that canvas not being lined up. Is that normal or not? I don't know. Um, the one that I had before this was pre-loved and I didn't really know that much about it. I guess I didn't really look it over very carefully. I just started using it. So let me know your thoughts on this. I'm actually going to the Northbrook store next week on Tuesday because I do have to take in a repair and I'll talk about that in this video too. And that's part of the reason that I did order this item but I really think this is a classic piece. The second item is this item from Gucci. Now I knew that this was my item I was waiting for from Gucci when it came today because I got a notification that it was coming. So I knew this was the Gucci item that I was waiting for and it was the only package I was supposed to get today. And like I said, I thought it was coming tomorrow but it actually came a day early which is why I wanted to film for you right now because I'm so excited and I do wanna start using this item right away. So without further ado, let me show you what it is. Now I did go ahead and just cut the tape on it to make it easier to open but when you open the box this is what it looks like inside and I'll tell you something this is the first brand new item I've ever gotten from Gucci from the website I did go ahead and order this item over the phone with a Gucci client advisor a few days ago and it was a really good experience this is the first brand new Gucci item I've ever received the other Gucci items I have are pre-loved so I'm really excited about this look at this Wow, I really like this. Look at this little mini canvas bag, you guys. I've never seen anything like this. Wow, I really like this. I would like use this as a little mini tote. Do you see that? That's really cute. I've never seen anything like that. I like it a lot. And then, I'm guessing this is just my receipt and my paperwork. And then, oh, look at this. Look at how pretty that packaging is. I love that. I'm obsessed with this green color right now. I love this shade of green. I just love it. I'm really obsessed with it right now. That's really pretty. That is really, really pretty packaging. I really like that. 
So this is the item. Do any of you have any guesses as to what it might be? So when I take off the ribbon, open the box, here it is. So I guess that little canvas mini shopping bag was an extra because here is the dust bag that it comes in. And the item I picked up from Gucci is this. It is their calfskin leather six ring key holder. This is really pretty and I really like how tiny this is. I really like that. Do you see that really beautiful shiny gold hardware and the nice rich red color? Now this particular six ring key holder comes in red and black. I thought the red would be kind of fun just to add a little bit of a pop of color. I tend to go for more neutrals as far as my handbags are concerned, but I really do like adding color sometimes in my SLGs. In opening it, it's kind of wrapped up. I'll take all that off. So on the inside of this, you do have your care cards and everything that come with it. So I took everything out of the inside and this is what it looks like. And I think this is a little slot right here where you can maybe hold some credit cards. We'll try that out and see if that works. One thing that did attract me to this was the fact that there is a little bit bigger key holder right in the center. My car key is really thick and bulky and I was wondering if it would do better on the center key ring. I like that. So I'm gonna try that out and see how I like it. Now, let me get to the reason why I did purchase these items. Like I said, Previously in the beginning of this video, I wasn't planning on purchasing these items at all. The reason I purchased these items is because this item, which is my trusty, used every day, multiple times a day, six ring key holder from LV, broke. Do you see that? The snap just came totally off of there. And I love this item, I use it all the time, and I just, absolutely love it and I did say in a previous video that if anything ever happened to this item I absolutely would replace it no questions asked because I use it every day I absolutely love it I love the functionality of this piece and I'm disappointed that this broke already I don't know how it happened because actually one morning I just went to reach for my keys and they were right by the door where I always keep them in kind of a catch-all right by the door and I just noticed this was open and I went to snap it shut and I found that I couldn't so I do plan to go to Louis Vuitton in Illinois next week to see about having this piece repaired I do want it repaired I do want to be able to use it but that is why I purchased these items because I don't want to be without a key holder in the space of time it's gonna take for them to possibly repair this item. So I wanted something else right away. And initially I was planning on just replacing this with another six ring key holder from LV and maybe getting a different pattern. I was actually considering getting the graffiti pattern from the men's line. They do have that in a six ring key holder and it's black checkered with silver hardware. And I was almost gonna get that one. But then I thought about it and I thought, you know, I wanna see what other designers have as far as key holders. So I thought that I would try this leather key holder from Gucci. It was actually a little bit less expensive than the six ring key holder from LV, but it is 100% calfskin leather. So I do really like that. I will put prices on the screen so you can see what the prices are offhand. I don't exactly remember. But the fact was I was asking about the key pouch as well because it is an iconic piece. It is a piece I use a lot because I was thinking, well, maybe I would just go to using that instead of using the six ring key holder. But when I tried that, I really found that my car key is so big. My keys just felt kind of bulky inside of that and it really didn't feel like I could get any cards that I would put inside of that with my keys out with any ease. So I decided that I like the functionality of a six ring key holder better than the key pouch to store my keys and hold my keys and utilize my keys. I love the LV key pouch, but for me, I like to use it as a mini wallet, a credit card holder, a rewards card holder, a little bit of a catch-all, and not really to store my keys. Just to give you a comparison side by side, look at how much smaller the Gucci key holder is. It's quite a bit smaller. And you can tell from a side view that it is quite a bit thicker. So actually, I was also considering getting the four ring key holder from LV just to have something a little bit more compact in my smaller bags, but maybe now I don't need to do that because maybe the Gucci key holder will work for that because it is so much smaller, although it is thicker. I am really curious to see if I can fit any 
credit cards or rewards cards in the Gucci six ring key holder. So let's find out. Okay, so I did grab some cards and I will tell you that I think that the answer to my question is a resounding no. I was able to fit two credit cards in here, but I had to really jam them in and now I can't get this closed. So <laughs> I hope I can get these out. Oh my goodness, they're really stuck now. I really, really jammed them in there. Oh, okay, that was a workout. <laughs> so I finally got the cards out. So I really don't think it will hold cards. So that's kind of a big deal to me. That's one of the things that I really, really love about the Louis Vuitton six ring key holder. It just is a fantastic catch all mini wallet for me. So many times, especially now with COVID, if I don't wanna take a handbag or if I'm just running out of the house, I can grab my keys and go and I have whatever I need and I love, love, love that. So I do really feel like this is a beautiful piece. I love how compact this is but I really don't know if this is a piece I would keep just because it doesn't have that functionality. However, one thing I will say, I think I will try this out in some of my smaller handbags just to see how it fits in like my Chanel wallet on chain and some of my smaller handbags because if it fits really well, then maybe I would use this because a lot of those smaller handbags that I have have built-in card holders or one thing that I've been using a lot lately instead of a wallet at all that I'm actually really loving is I've just been taking the Felici insert out of my Felici bag and using that as a wallet because I love how flat that is and I can see everything at a glance. So I've been using that and just transferring that particular piece from handbag to handbag so it is completely flat it doesn't fold up at all it doesn't add any bulk to your handbag so I really really like that and I've been using that a lot so I'm gonna maybe try that along with this piece and if it fits well in my smaller handbags then maybe I would keep this however I would say the fact that you can't carry cards in here is kind of a disappointment I really couldn't tell online but the reason is that this centerpiece isn't sewn down and so that's the reason that this particular piece doesn't hold any cards in it and I think even if I was able to secure this just the way it's designed I don't think that there would really be enough room in here to hold any cards however I will say I think it's beautiful I love the color I think it's really really pretty like I said, I'll try it in some of my smaller handbags, let you know the outcome. But I can tell you this, if it doesn't fit really well in my smaller handbags and allow me to have more space to put the other things in there that I need, then I think I have my answer and I think this is a piece that I'm not gonna keep because it probably won't work in my collection even though I think it is really beautiful. So let me know in the comments, do you have this piece? Do you use it? Do you like it? Do you have this piece and the LV six ring key holder. If you do, which piece do you like better? Which piece do you use more? I definitely plan on either replacing my six ring key holder or getting it repaired. I probably would get another six ring key holder or maybe the four ring from LV. Let me know if you have the four ring key holder and if you do, if you like it and if that piece fits in your smaller handbags because I'm thinking because that piece is canvas that it might be more slim and might fit even better in my smaller handbags than this piece because the leather is thicker. But let me know your thoughts. I would really love to hear from you. If you need any other gift ideas for your husband, for your brother, for your son, for any other man in your life, make sure you check out my men's gift guide video. As I said before, I will be sharing a lot more gift guide videos upcoming in the weeks leading up to Christmas. So make sure you subscribe and ring the bell if you don't wanna miss those videos. Make sure you follow me on Instagram also so you don't miss my Instagram live streams that I do every Saturday morning at 9 a.m. Central Standard Time. I'd love to see you over there when we live chat. But we with that, thank you so much for watching today. I will plan to see you in my next video. And remember, beauty begins the moment you decide to be yourself and confidence is the most important accessory that you can wear.